Leader of Arizona's largest city officially stepping down. Greg Stanton resigning today as mayor of Phoenix. He's stepping aside after more than six years at the helm. Vice Mayor Thelda Williams replaces him on an interim basis. Now Stanton is setting his sights on a job on Capitol Hill. And on his first day of full-time campaigning, he's already taking heat from a competitor. ABC 15's Melissa Blasia spoke with both congressional hopefuls. As Greg Stanton leaves the mayor's office to campaign for Congress full time, he says he has great pride in the accomplishments we've had in Phoenix on economic development, especially all the new businesses moving downtown. So not only are we growing fast in terms of population, we're growing in terms of wages, in terms of the right type of jobs. So I'm excited about the future of the city. Greg Stanton's time to bask in accomplishments cut short by a Republican opponent in the 9th District Congressional race. Retired Navy doctor Steve Ferrara throwing shade about campaign contributions. Because he's already, you know, raised over $110,000 in fundraising money from people who have interest with the city. Ferrara questions the appearance of a sitting mayor receiving so much money from developers and lobbyists. See, they see Washington, D.C. as, I mean, they call it the swamp or whatever you want, a place where, it, you know, the politicians are not trusted because of exactly those kind of conflicts of interest. Stanton, who's a Democrat, is responding, saying that he has received the most donations of any candidate in the race from all kinds of people. And he stands on his reputation as an ethical public servant. All I can tell you is that when I make decisions, it's on the merits. And I've got a strong track record of making the right decisions on the merits as mayor of the city of Phoenix. The primary elections at the end of August and the general in November. Reporting in Phoenix, Melissa Blasius, ABC 15, Arizona.